Now, residents in Mpape area of the Federal Capital Territory have appealed to the Federal Capital Territory Administration to stop the demolition of houses and shops. They also want authorities to make alternative plans for them to go about their business. Now, correspondent Maria Mohammed reports. There is a growing influx of people into the FCT to either seeking greener pastures or escaping from conflict and unrest in other parts of the country. This has brought with it ugly consequences, leading to a proliferation of urban slums in the territory. All sections of the city today have issues with unplanned and unsightly settlements from Lube to Guarimpa. Sadly, these squatter settlements neither conform with the Abuja master plan nor the city's development control regulations. A major reason is that many residents approach local chiefs illegally to acquire land and build structures in a bid to have houses of their own and escape the high cost of accommodation in Abuja. Another reason is that many of those who came into Abuja with lofty dreams of making it big in business often find that it's not easy to set up in the federal capital. They often resort to setting up illegal structures to run their trade. Stella David, a food vendor, is a mother of five children and used to own her own mini restaurant where she sold food. She was affected by recent demolition of houses and shops carried out in Mpape. She told us she moved to Mpape five years ago when her old restaurant was demolished by the FCTA. She now appeals to the administration to give her and many others an alternative as they can't afford to buy or rent places considered appropriate. They should leave us here. They will not see us in the town. They say we want to rent house. We don't even have money to rent house in the town. But we are managing here to live in our life. They should stop demolition. They should stop to demolish our houses. Please, I'm making them. So you can survive. Because if you demolish, there's, so there's people, plenty of people that have heart attack, hypertension. If they collapse now die, what will happen to their children? Other victims of demolition in Impape also share their own experiences they say things have been very tough for them. They also seek adequate compensation from the administration. And where we are now, even government is here to come and demolish this place. Every time we continue to run, as if to say we are foreigners. We are not foreigners. We are donors of the land. Let them help us uh, for we to establish our business because we are looking for money to establish another business. As in this one is not moving, we can move on to another one and all those things. But that appeal does not hold sway with the FCTA, who instead advises residents to build in accordance with the territory's urban and regional plan to avoid altering the Abuja master plan. The authorities warn that it will not hesitate to bring down any illegal structure. Abuja does not have a customary land title. So when you buy from them, you put yourself in danger and so that when the time comes for us to remove uh, your structure, we'll remove your structure because the agreement you have lost most times. It's been a hard time for most Nigerians, but residents here in Mpape want the federal government to come to their aid by reducing the rate of demolition as they have nowhere else to go. Mariam Mohamed, TVC News, Abuja.